Galnet News Update, 9th of May 3309. The long-awaited Thargoid Pulse Neutralizer is available, and the first tranche of commanders have already journeyed to the heart of the Maelstrom to discover what lies at their core. The advance comes as a result of a research programme involving Aegis, Professor Palin and Ram Tarr, who are indebted to those who delivered commodities to enable mass production of the Pulse Neutralizer. Some commanders who assisted will have been gifted one of the modules at the Aegis megaship Oron Miller, but everyone else can buy them from the technology broker at rescue ships. For every pulse neutralizer, you'll need to provide the following. 5. Massive Energy Surge Analytics 1. Unclassified Relic 5. Propulsion Elements and 5. Sensor Fragments The Energy Surge Analytics are a byproduct of trying to get to the middle of a maelstrom without a pulse neutralizer. You make the unclassified relic by feeding a guardian relic into the device at the heart of a Thargoid structure. The propulsion elements and the sensor fragments can be collected by blowing up Thargoid ships or scavengers, and by blowing up Thargoid sensors. If you take them to a technology broker, the technology broker will give you one of the shiny new pulse neutralizers, and that, together with the caustic sink launcher that you hopefully already have, and a fast ship, is all you'll need to get into the maelstrom. The next tricky bit is when you reach the 50 km boundary. When the maelstrom turns white, crackles and then starts to pulse, you need four pips to system and to activate the pulse neutralizer. Too soon and you get repulsed. Too late and you get repulsed. Just right and you're through. There seem to be two pulses so you need to repeat the process a second time. And then, all of a sudden, the caustic corrosion stops, the whirling energy stops, and you find yourself in an asteroid field. It's quite nice in there, at least until the Thargoids turn up to welcome you. The new hunter ship, also known as the Glaive, may come to say hello. And there are rumours that if you fly to the very centre of the Eye of the Maelstrom, there may be something else to find. Galnet News Digest is currently unable to confirm this as its ships came under repeated assault by hunters and interceptors. We shall continue our investigations and possibly report further tomorrow. Professor Alba Tezra has sent a number of Aegis researchers into the core. Their and our mission is to identify what lies at the centre of the maelstrom and to gather information that may help us to encourage the Thargoids to end their invasion. Admiral Aidan Tanner has wisely suggested that it would be a good idea to outfit your ship carefully before venturing into the core of the maelstrom. <laughs> <laughs>